if you have your lentils and ripe plantains then let's go to the kitchen i'll show you how i made this delicious meal let's go so i got my ingredients ready this time around i used two cups of lentils and about five ripe plantains so i went ahead to soak the lentils so i soaked the lentils for about 30 minutes so not less than 30 minutes and i went ahead to prep other ingredients so i peeled cut the plantains and here i am putting some of the lentils into my blender and some of the ripe plantains and some of the ingredients you know to blend them as much as my blender can contain okay so the blending here was done twice you know because of the size of my uh, blender cup so i put some salt and um, i put almost all the ingredients that i needed so i put some oil and i put some salt you know and uh, some water so I went ahead to cover my blender and I blended it. So the mix, the mixture I put inside a bowl and um, yeah, I got my spatula to you know turn it. And I have this tinned mackerel fish. If you have fresh one, fresh mackerel, you can go ahead and boil and put here. But I already have a tinned um, mackerel in tomato sauce and i went ahead to crush some of the fish you know so that every scoop of the batter we have a piece of fish so you can use you can choose to add any protein of your choice here i use fish you can use some meat if you like wherever you like you can put egg or you can put every protein that you like it's up to you and you can decide not to even put anything like if you're a vegetarian you can decide not to put any of this anyway so this was my choice and i tasted um for salt and it was just on point okay so the next stage i went ahead to get my aluminium foil so there's a way i prepare a pocket whenever i want to make uh moi moi like this so i got my aluminium foil and i divided into two i got a good size i'll show you just watch what i did here i'm trying to make a pocket so that um i will have somewhere to scoop it will be easy to scoop in the butter into the aluminium foil pocket but if you have other containers or if you have leaves or you you know here just be creative just do what you know will work so what i'm trying to make here is to make a pocket and what i did was to seal the opposite edge i folded into two and i sealed the other edges and i left one open so in case you didn't understand i'm going to repeat it again in the next slide so that's it like this okay and yeah and i had to scoop in my butter into it easy easy peasy but if you have a container fine that works too and you know so just do whatever works if you have some leaves fine just do whatever works so yeah this worked for me and look at it voila and i went ahead to do the second time i repeated the process so that was what i kept doing until the butter was um was all done it was a very good experience i had fun doing this like i had fun doing doing this i've done it so many times so it was a fun time for me okay so i went ahead to the next process i got my parchment paper so the reason why i'm lining on my pot with a parchment paper is so that there will be no to reduce the sticky effect and again maybe if the water is dry so there will be no you know burnt feeling or burnt sensation or burnt situation as the case may be okay so because we're going to steam this process this meal this recipe is um is the one that you have to steam okay so we use steam to cook it so after carefully lining my butter that i have secured in my aluminium pocket you know so i try to line them up in a very nice way so that they, every every one of them will have um 
you know, we have some room. So I added water, like I told you, we're going to use steam to cook this. So I added good quantity of water into the pot and that was it. And I covered it and allowed it to cook. So I left it for about, say, 30 to 45 minutes, but I, I, I had to check. So when it was cooked, I opened one of the one of the <laughs> pockets so that's me carefully opening it that's it my lentil plantain moi moi is cooked yummy looking yeah and i use it as a side dish for my rice okay and use it as a side dish for anything thank you